Hi, in this video we're going to talk about something called bed mass, or I'm sorry, bod mass, or in some countries called bed mass. And what that really is talking about is the order of operation. In other words, what do we do first in an equation? So I've got some uh, example equations set out here. And bod mass or bed mass is really just an acronym, and it's uh, put in, it tells you in order what operations you should do when. So, for example, the B is for brackets. That means that everything inside brackets has to be done first. Then order or exponents. Uh, in this example, in this video, I'm not doing any because this is mainly for year six, uh, key stage two. So you probably won't get too many of those. Uh, division. Okay, so division is right after brackets or order. Multiplication. The A is for addition and the S is for subtraction. Okay, so this literally says, do whatever is in the brackets first, then go to the next step, next step, next step, and so on until you're done. All right, so let's see how it works uh, for real. We have uh, 9 multiplied by bracket 4 plus 4 and then a bracket. Well, our order of operations, our, our bod mass rule, says that we have to do whatever is in the uh, brackets first. So we write down this part here, because we're not working with it yet brackets and then we just add 4 plus 4 which is 8 okay and if you want you can get rid of the brackets you don't really need them there so now 9 times 8 is 72 and solved okay that's how you do it let's have a look at this one uh, this one is 14 plus 7 multiplied by 3 so 14 plus 7 well if you know your times tables or your multiplication tables you should know that that's 21 Okay, and then we just write multiplied by 3. So 21 multiplied by 3 is going to be 63. Okay, easy peasy. Okay, so next one is uh, bracket 16 divided by 4, bracket subtract 3. That division symbol might be hard to see, so uh, this is division. Okay, 16 divided by 4. Again, you need, if you, you need to know your multiplication tables. 16 divided by 4 is 4. And now you're just subtracting 3 is going to leave you with 1. Okay? Super hard. Not really. Okay. So you can try these three on your own. This one is uh, for those of you who want a real challenge. Um, so you can do these three on your own. Stop the video. Work on them. Uh, and then you can play the video again and see if I got what you got. All right. So pause the video. And then... Uh, you can check your work, okay? Okay, so as I said in the uh, first part, you have to do everything that's in the brackets first. So 10 subtract 5 is just going to be 5, and this is 38. You bring, bring down the 38, and you subtract it. So 38 minus 5 is going to be 33, okay? 77 divided by 11, again, it's in the brackets. We have to do this first. But you'll notice over here that even if there weren't brackets, right, because it's division, you would do that before any of the other actions, okay, any of the other operations. Okay, so 77 divided by 11 is going to be 7, multiplied by 4. 4 sevens are 28 if you know your multiplication tables. All right, this one's a little bit harder, at least it looks a little bit harder, but in reality it's, it's not, that, not that bad. 125 subtract 99 is going to be just 26. All right. Multiplied by, and then 36 divided by 18. Well, again, if, you, uh, if you're good with uh, multiplication tables, then you'll know that that's basically 2. All right. Plus 3. Now we go back over here and we see that um, multiplication has to come before addition and subtraction. So there's our multiplication there. There's our addition. So this part here has to come last, okay, because there's no subtraction. So 26 multiplied by 2 is going to give us 52 plus 3 gives us 55. All right. I hope this has been helpful. Good luck.